The video this morning is about the what if questions that we have about our partner when we're struggling with sexual performance anxiety. And the question that I hear up uh, here that comes up quite often is, what if one of us ends up cheating because we're not happy? What if one of us ends up cheating because we're not happy? So this may be a thought that has gone through your mind, wanting to please your partner and at the same time struggling with the fact that you feel you can't do that sexually but wanting them to be happy and it can lead to all sorts of thoughts. One thing that I learned that just helped me to uh, relax and calm down a bit in those moments because it's human nature for us to kind of create the worst possible scenario in our minds, actually feel like we go there and have all of this fear and dread and terror around it and the reality is we're not in that situation. You know, the partner hasn't cheated or the relationship hasn't gone to shit because of this. Of course, we still want to get it fixed, right? But it's just making sure that we don't create even more fear for ourselves because that can add even more pressure. So a tip that I found really useful is when I have thoughts like this is to realize that Usually when we have an intense thought or situation, we make it bigger than what it actually is, or we kind of travel forward into the future and imagine, oh my God, if that happened. And just notice when those thoughts come into your mind, and when you do the thing of going into the future and feeling all of the fear and scariness and terror around it, just take a breath and notice, okay, actually that moment, I'm not in that moment right now, I'm here right now and what's one step that I can take from here to be able to get this fixed. Okay, so that's it. So just to recap, when you notice the thought and you notice you go into the future and live this ter um, scary terror moment like it's real, just take a deep breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. Why breathing, by the way, is because it's the one thing that can calm down the nervous system as quickly as possible. So that's why you see me talking about that a lot. So take a breath and then realize, okay, I'm actually, I'm not there in that future scary moment. I'm here right now. What's one thing that I can do from here? If that's been helpful for you, below in the comments, you'll see the link to my newsletter. And each week I will send you the latest tools and guidance so that you can fix sexual performance anxiety and avoid a permanent erection problem. Thank you.